Jeremiah, with all respect, is when it becomes fun to kill people and to spend all, an entire day killing people and running over prostitutes, then that's the problem. It is a pleasurable, fun thing for you to be doing, and that's, that's not helpful. In the video game, not in real life. In real life, you have consequences. On the video game, you just start a new game. Yeah. Well, well, let, let me jump in here for a minute, Jack. Uh, okay. Jeremiah, I want to ask you a question. This is the host, Pat Campbell, here. Um, yeah. Help me understand this, because I'm a parent. I've got five children of my own. But when I was when I was your age, well, let me let me ask it this way: Why would you choose to spend your time playing a game where you're having virtual sex with a prostitute? Why would you choose to spend your time that way? And the reason I'm asking is, when I was your age, I was interested in girls, not playing games. And I just, I guess, I maybe maybe I'm too old. Maybe I just don't get it. Why would you choose to spend your time that well, way? I, I go out on dates every weekend. I, I just do the video games yeah, at yeah, night. Yeah, yeah. Jeremiah. Jeremiah, with all respect, you're not a statistically significant uh, sample of of the teenage generation. You know, first of all, I thank goodness that you're healthy, happy, and so forth. But you aren't you aren't the whole deal. There are kids out there that are at risk. Ted Bundy, hours before he was executed, said that the hardcore, violent pornography he, he consumed was like a training manual on how to inflict the maximum amount of pain upon his victims. You know, I, I think, why can't you, I, Jeremiah? Listen, let me, with with all respect, let me just say this: you got to get beyond yourself, Jeremiah. It's not just about you; it's about young girls and uh, and women and other people who are victims in school shootings who have rights too. Won't you be willing? To, don't and, you understand? Have, don't you understand that there is some linkage between how an entire generation is spending its spare time in these types of horrific massacres? Well, see, my thing is, there's no need to, you know, shut down video game producers. Just because nobody's you know, trying to shut them down. I'm and, trying to stop them from selling it to 12 year olds. And that's why they have the mature rating on it. Nobody under okay. 17 years of age should be buying these games. Uh, that's, that's okay. Then you and I agree. Now, will you will you tell the people out there that you think that if a kid who's 13 walks into Best Buy in Tulsa this week? That he shouldn't be able to buy this game without. Shouldn't he? he shouldn't? Not that okay, thing. well that's all so I'm saying. Say that it's okay for him to buy it. That's why this says parental advisory. That and and if a parent Jeremiah, if his parent isn't there, then the retailer should do what they say they do, and that is check ID and yep. say, "I'm sorry, young man, you're 13. I won't sell it to you." But the Federal Trade Commission has found that you can walk into Best Buy if you're 13 and buy the games like this, and they don't check your ID. So you and I agree on that. The industry needs to do what it says it does. You're on the same page. You're on the same page. Jack, hold that thought. I need to take a quick break. Jack Thompson, my guest. Your calls, 460-1170, 460-1170. You're listening to the Pat Campbell Show on Talk Radio 1170 KFAQ. Back with more. Eight fifty one. You're listening to Talk Radio eleven seventy KFAQ, the program, the Pat Campbell Show. I'm your host, my guest attorney Jack Thompson. We're talking about Grand Theft Auto Four, uh, which is just about to be released here. This is a game. I guess the best way to explain this to people who aren't involved in gaming this would this would be akin. This is so sexually explicit. This would be like putting a hardcore pornographic magazine in the hand of a thirteen year old boy or a hardcore porno video in the hand of a 13-year-old. And, and, and no person, no adult out there in their right mind would think that's an okay thing. Why should it be any different with the uh, with uh, Grand Theft Auto 4? And, Jack, you're, you're calling on our, our district attorney, right. Tulsa County District Attorney Tim Harris, to do what? And, by the way, it's worse than that because interactive in which you actually are doing the sex is far more harmful and behavior-modifying right. than passive consumption of it. I'm asking Mr. Harris to, in fact, enforce the... Oklahoma sexual material harmful to minors statute. This is not even a close call. This is clearly pornography, which should be adult rated, and which the rating itself on the game says is mature and contains, quote, strong sexual content. So the, the mistake that the industry has done is give this a rating which allows it to be sold to minors. Uh, uh, that is someone who's 17 but under 18, and so that one-year hiatus 
is a window of tremendous vulnerability to those retailers in Tulsa County that sell it. Uh, Tim, here's what's at his own website. As your Tulsa County District Attorney, I will strive to incarcerate violent offenders, protect victims' rights, hold juvenile offenders accountable, advocate for children, preserve family values, and uphold the laws and constitutions of our great state and country. Yeah, I, I expect you to hear from him. He's a, yeah. he's a good guy, oh, and he's I also know. a big fan of the station. Yeah. I can tell he's a good guy. And his phone number, if you want to encourage him in that regard, I won't give it out unless you want me to, Pat. Uh, don't, don't give it out okay. off air. I, I, I would expect him. You're going to probably hear back from him right. before noon. He'll, well, he'll get back with you. Let's, let's go to the phones and talk to uh, Tommy. You're on the Pat Campbell Show with Jack Thompson. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I'm telling you, I'm cowering in fear from this man, and I am not kidding. I, Why are you? I, I, are you Strauss Downlink, the chairman of Take Two? No, you. You are so aggressive in your. Oh, thank ability. you. Yeah, and and I want to call on behalf of this poor little 18 year old that you just smeared off the map. The power. Of I the was. Group. I thought it was very nice to him. When I'll, I I'll just try to throw a whole sentence out there. Uh, uh, the power of the group that you enforce over the individual, you, you literally were willing to tell this young man that his individual statistic, his, his data mark somehow was insignificant. It is. Uh, uh, it, that's what I'm saying. This is scary because the whole country was built <laughs> to protect the, the trace element, the statistical no, no, no. Uh, insignificant. Sure, sure. Uh, I'm Jack, concerned at, no. The 18 year old no, no, no. Left. See, you're the one who's not concerned about everyone. Why would what I'm concerned, what I'm concerned much. about is all the teenagers out there who are being sold this stuff, all the kids who are in harm's way who are going to school with the others who will act out this stuff. And it's, it's interesting that Jeremiah's parents are so derelict uh, in their duties that they bought him this game when he was 13, or maybe he walked into Best Buy and bought it himself, and his parents, knowing that, let him uh, continue you know, to play it. Do you know his parents? Uh, I, I think I know enough, and that you is sl- that... You it, certainly it, sling the pejorative. Sir, place. sir, I, I, okay, I'll tell this categorically, and if you're offended, please be offended. I'm any not, parent I'm, who would I'm, let their I'm kid... Any parent, a socialist any, Tommy, Tommy, parent, Tommy, let him finish. Go ahead. Any parent who would let their kid and know that they were playing Grand Theft Auto, Vice City, or San Andreas is a derelict... Any person who goes around videotaping secretly is uh, uh, deceitful and a <laughs> I'm sorry. In a public area, oh. the law in this country is you can videotape a kid Fantastic, buying a, an adult deceitful. video game. He, Tom, was, Tommy, he's filming his own kid. Why can't you film your own kid? Kind of sick in its own way, I guess. No, sir. But I'll, but I'll tell you what, the police... <laughs> you ever hear family do, videos? Do, do the police not also use video game style training? In their yes, they do, the and, and, guess, yeah, okay. and, guess, and guess what they do? They train you to kill the bad guys, not the good guys. In Grand Theft they, Auto, they train you, kill, you to take down in Grand, the public. I'll tell you, you're a little wound up this morning. I'd <laughs> cut I'm back on the coffee. <laughs> The, Go ahead. The, 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 the police teach you, and, and it's their job to be the thin blue line between, between sociopaths and the rest of us, and they're trained to kill the bad guys, not the good guys. In Grand Theft Auto, you kill all the police, and you run over innocent bystanders with your car. Little little advice for Tommy: just just say no to crystal meth. <laughs> let's, well, let's I, don't know, I don't know what his problem is, but I, you know. He's, he, oh, never mind. Just say no. Let's go to uh, Mike. Mike, you're next. Hey, how's it going, you two? Good. You got a oh, question or a comment for Jack? Yeah. Uh, hey, Mr. Thompson. I'm hey. just curious. Um, I know you're an, uh, not older, but uh, yeah, I am. In the older generation. Yeah, I'm uh, smarter. Than respect, that. but uh, <laughs> <laughs> you ever play uh, Cowboys and Indians when you were a kid? Yes, I did. And guess what? If mm-hmm. somebody actually got hurt, Colonel Grossman makes this point excellently. And you saw blood flow, the game stopped, and you went to mom and she put a Band-Aid on it. In this game, if you blow somebody's brains out and you see the viscera on the screen, that's a good thing. And you right. keep and playing and you kill more people. Right. Grand, but the, the, there's Cowboys a, there's, and Indians there's, there's, is role-playing. It doesn't desensitize you to the act of killing so that you you become... Uh, delighted by seeing somebody's blood. Hey, hey, Mike, Mike, if I bring Jack to town, I promise you I'll keep him away from the casinos. I got <laughs> to end by, on that by, word. By the way, they promote this game uh, uh, by saying when you shoot a cop, you can actually, quote, see the pain in his face now. Jack Thompson, is always a pleasure. We thank you for stopping by, sir. Thank you, Pat. Appreciate it. We are out of time. Don't forget to join me, PC, bright and early tomorrow morning, 6 to 9, here.